just like a CEO is responsible for ensuring that a company achieves its mission statement, our soul is responsible for achieving its ultimate purpose of reuniting with God. However, just like a company has multiple departments that need to work harmoniously to achieve its targets, our human existence also consists of a body, mind, and emotions, each with their own goals and complexities. It is the role of the soul to oversee and govern the harmonious workings of these aspects, just like a CEO oversees and harmonizes the workings of different departments of a company. To achieve life's mission statement, the first step is for the soul to remember itself as a part of God and connect with the divine light and sound of God. This awakening provides the strength needed for the soul to take its rightful place as the CEO and convene the meeting with the body, mind, and emotions to remind them of their joint mission and help them understand how each stands to benefit from it. This meeting is the process of meditation, where the body, mind, and emotions are stilled, and our being experiences the joy and bliss of the inner world. Through a daily practice of meditation, ethical living, recognition of the oneness of God's creation, and letting His love flow from us to all in our orbit, we can take steady steps toward fulfilling life's supreme purpose. The key is to let the soul govern and harmonize the workings of the body, mind, and emotions so that we can achieve our ultimate goal of reuniting our soul with the divine.